This segment of Delmarva Life is brought to you by Delaware Electric Cooperative. How about this view? Can't you just feel the energy? This is Delaware Electric Cooperative's Bruce A. Henry Solar Farm just west of Georgetown. If you've seen it before, it might look a little bigger than you remember. Well, that's because the farm just expanded by 17 acres and a few thousand solar panels. The co-op's president and CEO says it was possible due to a partnership. Here's Delmarva Life's Katie Zerilli. There's a whole lot of energy at the Bruce A. Henry Solar Farm in Sussex County. Not only because of what's coming down from the sun, but also because the farm just underwent a big expansion project. 17 acres to be exact. We had actually designed this facility so that we could expand it to a true 40 acres. But we were waiting for the right time when the cost of solar came down or we were able to purchase a, a facility here, allow somebody to come in on our land, build the facility, and we buy the energy in what's called a PPA, a power purchase agreement. President and CEO of Delaware Electric Co-op, Bill Andrews, says they found that somebody in Constellation Energy. That's who funded the expansion. More than 10,000 solar panels were installed here over the last few months, which means energy for an additional 400 homes. The combined 40 acres of solar panels are now producing enough clean energy to power nearly 1,000 homes and at an affordable rate. This will allow many of our members to be able to have solar on their home even though they might not be able to afford it. Solar energy is not as cheap or as cost effective as regular energy that we have on our system. But by having this solar farm and us building this and utilizing the REC to meet our needs, we can actually provide our membership for $10 a month through our community solar program, the ability to have their entire home served by renewable energy. Better for the environment too. This offsets fossil fuel electric generation, thus preventing the release of thousands of metric tons of carbon dioxide. It offsets the carbon footprint and Delaware Electric Cooperative is very focused on carbon footprint. How clean is the energy that we produce to serve all of our membership and we've been doing very well. And the co-op takes it to the next level by investing the dollars from members into other clean energy projects. The first 23 acres of this solar farm, 16,000 panels, were built back in 2013. Seven years later, they were ready for more. The most exciting part about our expansion has to be the fact that we were prepared to take advantage of the opportunity to bring this to our membership, to maximize the value that we had originally set out for, and to meet the needs of our members in a clean and efficient manner. And it doesn't stop here. Bill says the co-op is dedicated to continually improving what it takes to generate power while keeping it affordable for members. He adds that additional solar projects are possible this year. We have several properties that we have under contract at this point in time that we are looking at making expansions. The expansion process itself is very time consuming in order to receive all the permitting and, and rights of way and uh, zoning that's required for it. Not only um, we want to make sure that the solar farm is placed uh, in a correct position, but we want to make sure that it doesn't impact or it minim minimizes the impact to our membership. It's not hard to see this is something he truly believes in. Because it's something that uh, nature gives us and something that we can utilize the value immediately to not only bring better opportunities for our lives, but make sure that we don't impact the environment around us. A project that's powerful in just about every way. Pretty amazing, isn't it? Now, if you're interested in learning more about Delaware Electric Cooperative, all you have to do is go to delmarvalife.com.